hello good day guys you're welcome again to my channel this is joshua the designer and in today's tutorial i'll be showing you something quite simple how we can actually batch edit our column properties our column sizes without um, altering individual elements all right so there's a way we can actually edit sizes all together at once and yeah, now that's what i'm showing you in in this moment all right so coming to this left side of your product structure environment you find columns and whatever story you want to apply the edit or the editing so you find columns on that particular story then you right click the column then you find the column table select the column table now this is what i mean you will discover that these column sizes you find that we have um, different elements or different parameters rather b1 in millimeters e1 in millimeters that's the eccentricity anyway b2 also in millimeters e2 in millimeters also so if you like to edit any of these um, columns instead of doing it one after another like this to edit whatever you want to do you can actually create an editing for all at once if it will apply in that sense all right so and um, what you do is you just find this tool <clears throat> pardon me find that tool on this um, particular pop-up and that's for column wise edit by the time you apply that it would bring this box for you because i've formally selected that particular color and that's why it was able to bring out b1 right so let's try it again so i'll show it to you if i'm to edit this and i'm on b1 already if you want to edit b2 selecting that b2 would actually highlight all the column right all the elements in that column right so you get, you check your column wise edit clicking that you find b2 then you can actually enter the parameters that you intend to change so if this was formerly 150 all through so i can actually attempt to change that to 2 to 5 and see how it would affect all the parameters in that very column right so you can see now that on my B2 column, I have 2 to 5 mm all through now. And that's a way to edit your column by batch in column wise. Thank you very much. If you have any question, you can actually get to the comment section. I'll be there to answer you. Thank you very much. See you in the next video. Bye.